फिर सर की जगह फाइन पॉइंट ऑफ कांटेक्ट एंड इक्वेशन ऑफ कॉमन टेंजेंट कॉमन टेंजेंट सेम क्वेश्चन वी डिड अर्लियर आल्सो इन सर्कल्स यूनिट व्हाट दे हैव गिवन टू सर्कल्स s is equal to x square plus y square minus 2x minus 4y minus 20 equals to 0 s dash equals to x square plus y square plus 6x plus 2y minus 90 equal to 0 For proving two circles touch each other, we have to find G is equals to F is equals to half of then C, then G dash which is half of this one, F dash is equals to half of coefficient of y, C dash is minus 90, C1 we have to write minus G minus F, that is 1 comma 2, C dash C2 is equals to minus G dash comma minus F dash, which is minus 3 comma minus 1. Then radius one root over g square plus f square minus c, which is root over one plus four minus of minus twenty. Root twenty five is five. Then radius two root over g d g dash square plus f dash square minus c dash. So this is nine plus one minus of minus ninety. Root hundred is ten. Then c one c two distance root over x two minus x one whole square plus y two minus y one whole square. Which is 16 plus 9, 25 is 5. We have to find R1 plus R2 and R1 minus R2. R1 plus R2, 5 plus 10, 15. R1 minus R2, 5 minus 10 minus 5, which is 5. Now we have to check C1, C2 with R1 plus R1, R1 minus R2. Compare this one. This is equal to R1 minus R2. Therefore, C1, C2 is equal to R1 minus R2. If it is equal to any one of them, circles touches each other or touch each other. This is the case. One circle touch each other. We need to find point of contact now. Second bit is point of contact. For point of contact, m x two minus n x one by n minus n. Why not plus sign? Then we will take point of contact with plus sign. And this one, if minus is there, then we are considering to be minus sign. M is to n is equals to R one is to R two. That is equals to five is to ten, which is one is to two. Then C one C two from C one C two x one y one and x two y two we have to consider. So what is the point of contact? M x two M is one x two is minus three minus n x one by n minus n. Then m y two, m into y two minus one minus n y one by n minus n. So this is minus three minus two by minus one minus one minus four by minus one. So which is minus five by minus one is five minus five by minus one is five. This is point of contact. Then what they have asked after point of contact? Equation of common tangent. Equation of common tangent is s minus s dash equal to zero. S is x square plus y square minus two x minus four y minus twenty. Then minus s dash minus x square minus y square minus six x minus two y plus ninety equal to zero. X square and y square cancel. Minus two x minus six x is minus eight x minus four y minus two y minus six y minus twenty and minus plus ninety. Plus seventy equal to zero. If minus sign, if you want to take common, then two also you can take common. So what we have to consider already we did the same problem in circles unit.
is the question if the circles two circles touch each other already they have mentioned touch each other we have to show that f dash is equal to fg dash so what you have to do sir given circles are there let s equals to circle 1 2gx plus 2fy plus 0 equal to 0 h dash equal to circle 2 x square plus y square plus 2g dash x plus 2f dash y plus 0 equal to 0 there is no c value then g is equal to g f is equal to f c is equal to 0 similarly g dash is g dash itself f dash is f dash and c dash is 0 then what we have center 1 minus g comma minus f center 2 minus g dash comma minus f dash then radius 1 root of g square plus f square minus c so root of g square plus f square c is not there r2 root over g dash square plus f dash square minus c dash so which is g dash square plus f dash square because there is no c dash we have r1 r2 what they have given touch each other so center 1 center 2 distance we have to find x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square expand this one root over a square minus a plus b whole square is a minus b whole square itself a square plus b square minus 2ab here also same thing a square plus b square minus 2a 2f f dash this is c1 c2 given condition they have given circles touch each other we have to show they have given already they have mentioned that if the circles touch each other so we have to use the condition now condition is c1 c2 equals to r1 plus r2 so c1 c2 distance plus g dash square minus 2g g dash plus f square plus f dash square minus 2f f dash equals to r1 plus r2 root of g dash square plus f dash square these two conditions we have to square it on and after simplification we will get this answer first to remove this square we have to square it on both sides so this one becomes g square plus g dash square minus 2, 2 g d dash plus f square plus f dash square minus 2 f f dash equals to a plus b whole square this is a and this is b a square without root plus b square plus 2 a b a b means root of first one into second one then Common terms get cancelled. G square on opposite side. G dash square cancelled. F square cancelled. F dash square cancelled. So remaining on left side minus 2 into G G dash plus F F dash equals to 2 into root over multiplication. G square is multiplied to both of them. G square G dash square plus G square F dash square plus F square G dash square plus F square F dash square. Squaring on both sides minus sign will go we will get g square g dash square a square plus b square plus 2a equals to after squaring we will get g square g dash square g square f dash square f square g dash square plus f square f dash square cancelling the common terms these two common f dash square these are also common so we can write right side value first g square f square f dash square plus f square g dash square here goes that side minus 2 g g dash f f dash is equals to 0 then this is a square plus b square minus 2 a b so what we can write a minus b whole square equal to 0 so g f dash minus f g dash equals to 0 so we can have one term on left side this minus term goes to right side or simplify up to some extent an answer is given to you write down the answer what we have to do when two circles are given gfc g dash f dash c dash c1 c2 r1 r2 c1 c2 distance r1 plus r2 r1 
plus r prime c1 c2 you should equate and you have to square square it on both sides you will get the answer gf dash equal to f g dash Last question of this unit. We have straight line represented and intersects the circle. If a line line is intersecting the circle at A and B, then the equation is S plus lambda L equals to zero. This is system of circle. Such thing represented two lines. One line and circle is represented in S plus lambda L form. So what they have given, first we have to write whatever line is given to us, x cos alpha plus y sin alpha, p comes to left side, minus p, this equals to 0 is equation of line. Then circle, circle is s, what is s equation, x square plus y square, a square comes to left side, minus a square equals to 0. This is second, if you will not consider 0 is also no problem, 1 and 2. Now once we have uh, l and s, we have to write equation of system of circle equation of system of circle is s plus lambda l is equals to 0 s is x square plus y square minus a square plus lambda into l value x cos alpha plus y sin alpha minus p equals to 0 now what you have to do is this is equation number 3 from line and circle we can form s plus lambda l by seeing this Whenever L is given, S is given, you have to find the value. Then simplify this one and find G and F from this value. Cos alpha plus lambda y sin alpha minus lambda p equal to 0. If I arrange this one in order, x square plus y square plus lambda x cos alpha plus lambda y sin alpha equal minus a square minus lambda p equal to 0. G is equal to half of coefficient of x. And f is equal to half of coefficient of y. Leaving y whatever value that is considered to be f. See, leaving y don't think lambda is coefficient of y. Total thing with y is coefficient of y. Then center. Center equals to minus g comma minus f that is minus lambda by 2 cos alpha minus lambda by 2 sin alpha. We have center value. Then what you have to do? We have to prove that the circle with areas diameter. We have to write center lies on diameter. So center lies on diameter means what? Whatever value they have given line. Diameter is this line. So we have to substitute center on this one. 
x cos alpha x value is this one minus lambda by 2 cos alpha into cos alpha plus y sin alpha minus lambda by 2 sin alpha into sin alpha minus b is equals to 0 now what we have minus lambda by 2 common cos square alpha plus sin square alpha minus b equal to 0 minus lambda by 2 into 1 is equals to b minus lambda is equals to 2b therefore lambda is equals to minus 2b check once again what we have to do for such problem whenever a line represent by the circle and they, they have asking us ab as diameter equation of circle as ab as diameter is mentioned to you equation of circle we have to take equation of system of circle ab as diameter this one you have to write s plus lambda simplify find center because diameter is mentioned, center lies on diameter. Whatever line is there, L is diameter. Line is represented now. This line is here actually. It is intersecting from here to here, A to B. So center value, whatever center of this system of circle lies on the diameter, we got the value of lambda. Put lambda value in third equation. So what is the value we got? X square plus Y square minus A square plus lambda into x cos alpha plus y sin alpha minus b equal to 0. Hence proved. So practice those questions of system of circle. We will start new unit afterwards.